It's Faith from Moonkind Iron. We're with Travis from Cattle Decapitation at Metal Fest. So I got a couple questions for me from our listeners. Uh, you've been around for 13 years. What bands? About, about 11 or 12. 11, 11 or 12? 12. Okay. Like All right. Well, the internet lies. Yeah. Um, what bands initially heavily influenced your sound, and does that keep going throughout the years? I mean, we always come back to like our core sound, which is really frantic kind of sounding really kind of almost grindcore-ish sort of um, so I would say Repulsion, Terrorizer, Napalm Death, Carcass for, for sure uh, people like to call us a Carcass clone but that's just not the case um, uh, and that's pretty much it so we always try to come back to that core sound of ours. Very cool um, now I may be wrong on this but uh, you guys are vegetarians. Yes. Um, your does your lyrical content it puts animals in uh, humans in animals places. Is that is is that so, what you're trying to achieve? Or sort of. I mean, different? not not that cheeky and tongue, you know, and cheesy or whatever. Uh, try to put a little more thought and like artistic value to it. You know what I mean? So, but I mean, if you you could always, I guess you could uh, whittle it down to just to just that, but it's. it's a little more than that. I think it's there's a there's just a little bit more to it than that. But yeah, I mean, if you want to ballpark, okay. <laughs> if you're just to you know try to explain it to the naked ear, then yeah, that's probably what I'd say. Okay. Um. Now we want to ask you about the Ouroboros that's on your album cover yeah, for this most recent album. Yeah. It's very prominent, and it showed up several times on your other albums. Does that have any specific significance to your music? <sighs> Not so much to the music uh, definitely uh, lyrically it's loosely tied in I mean it, it's it's all about what comes around goes around sort of thing you know and uh, we are more into respecting the laws of nature which a lot of people will argue with us about because a lot of people think that humans are are here to you know if you need to kill to survive that's, that's one thing but a lot of people don't have to, especially the, lot, the majority of the people that buy into the meat industry, which is really what we have a problem with, not so much going out and killing something and eating it. If you have to do that to survive, of course, that's part of, that's our role in natural selection, but massive slaughter and, uh, and the industrialization at the level that we've done it is, I just think that's, it's cheating, it's stupid. It's, it's a I think it stands kind of directly in the way of nature taking its course. So that sort of loosely comes back to the person's That works. And finally, uh, it says here that you're into G.I. Joe. <laughs> yes, no, maybe. Damn, <laughs> firm I, or deny? I almost, wore, I almost wore my Storm Shadow shirt tonight, <laughs> too. Uh, I just picked up a, a Storm Shadow shirt yesterday. Nice. No, um, unfortunately I am. Uh, it's a serious uh, addiction. Well, no, no, not really. Just these new, the new 25th anniversary ones, the yeah. three and three quarter inch. I could give a shit less about the ones my dad played with, you know. But uh, the ones I played with in the 80s when I was a kid, uh, it was. I, it almost brought a tear to my eye to see it come back again. You know, I was just like, oh my god, this is crazy. But they're made in China, and uh, they're, you know, uh, it, it, it's a, it's glorification of, of war and, uh, and and shit like that but it's it's just a stupid it's me and my friends the guy our graphics layout guy and our manager we're all kind of secretly Joe freaks but uh, not to the point where I'm gonna spend a thousand dollars for the fucking for a seal you know 1980s one or something well you're not that bad <laughs> well yeah yeah no I know some people that have these absurd collections our manager is one of them but I just, uh, I, I just got, you know, I picked up one of the, you know, one of each of the, the new ones. And it's it's kind of cool, nostalgic thing, you know. There's nothing means. wrong with nostalgia. It's the only toy that I collect. In fact, my friend who is also a Joe head keeps, he's, oh, I picked, I picked up that toy for you. I'm like, stop calling it a fucking toy. <laughs> it's a not Joe. toys. Yeah, it's collectors it's item. Action figure. <laughs> action figure. It's not dolls. They're exactly. action figures. And one day I'll help make some money off of, a, of somebody. It's an investment. No, it's an investment. It is. Thanks for All right. Well, thank you very much. Thank you.